This playthrough is rated T for Teen. Greetings and salutations, viewers. Welcome right back here with another episode of Aegis of Earth, the Preventitus Assault. In the last episode, we, uh, I guess, pretty much covered everything we could do in Kimberly, at least for a while, as we've, uh, we were tasked by the Admiral to go to a new, t uh, new town, but it's not one step over, it's another continent over as we head to Africa and Medina. Although I guess where, wherever this takes place, I guess maybe the same conventions don't work for the world as they do before, because they've got names that probably wouldn't be named that normally, but yeah, what, what am I going through? Anyway, we've got a new commander, on the, or new operator on the team, Chica, and we lost Tark because he had a, a, a lack of confidence, so oh well. Got to swap out when, when you got it. So, uh, anyway, off screen, I did like three battles. Uh, I forgot to put uh, Chica in my uh, group the first battle so she didn't get any experience. So, I had to do two more battles after that just to level her up. So, uh, um, built some things, but not as much as I'd like. I'll need to save a bit more money and build all that stuff because it, the, the town doesn't come with like SUW and stuff like that. But we'll get to that when the game wants me to. So, uh, Hey, Chica, you're on break now, right? Wanna share a shack, shack, snack with me? Um... Um... Yay! Huh? I got these mail-order recently macaroons. You've gotta taste them. They are so tasty. Here, yeah, take whichever one you want. You can have no this way. pick. Uh, I don't really... Ooh. Well, okay, well, if you're not going to, then I'm sure I sure will. Now, let's see. I think I'll go for something blue. This blue, beautiful sky blue one. Something blue, something new, something old, something borrowed. See, these are the pleasures of life. Not wasting your time wearing light toe about finding the right guy. And that's true, sometimes stuff like that just falls in your laps. Pop. Honestly, I don't know why she bothers when it's never gonna happen. Oh, ouch. Why really have that lack of confidence in your friend? Or at least, if not a friend, then a, a teammate or, a, you know. Uh, now I'll think of the word later. That's so good. That oh yeah, I forgot her thing was she ate a lot. Yeah, like, that was important. That's right. There's something I can love for all eternity. Oh, how about you, Chica? Are you getting married anytime soon? No way. Who asked that randomly? I mean, has she talked about her life at all? Does she, has she mentioned like you know a loved one at all? No. That just seemed out of the blue. Ooh. But she's like, huh? And it's like, I'm not worried. When the time comes, I'll settle down. I guess there's nothing for you to worry about either. Some guys really dig the intellectual types. Is she good the intellectual type? I mean, she's got a headset thing on, so I guess so. Uh, dot, 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 dot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry. I just suddenly thought of something if Toa ever does get married instead of exchanging the usual vows. The priest can ask the groom, Toa or not Toa? That is the question. Is that funny? That was horrible. Hey. At least someone like, at least someone comments about how how she's torturing Toa for like no reason. Oh, I crack myself up sometimes. I really do. <laughs> You're a psychotic, hey, lady. Snap out of it, you drunk. <laughs> what does eating make her drunk, or at least act like that, like all loopy? Ow! Why did you hit me for Keo? <laughs> You're making Chica feel uncomfortable with your weird conversation huh? choices. Huh? Oh, really? Oh, um, thank you, Keo. I really don't know how much more I would have been able to take. <laughs> uh, she was, like, really just burying it. She's like, I don't want to talk to this lady. She's crazy. Yeah, yeah. You're welcome, Chisa. Uh, try to read the room better next time, okay? Hmm. Oh, I I'm sorry. Hey! Ooh, I've seen... Things are as live as ever over there. Okay. Oh yeah, where is she based off of? Is she can just come in every time and just give us blueprints? She didn't even have to build the thing. She just makes the blueprints. So she's ten. Did she? Well, no. Engineers make the blueprints. Architecture or is an architect makes the blueprints and engineers actually build them. Yeah. So she's more of an architect, isn't she? Huh. Oh hey there, Chandler. Can we? What can we do for you now? Or have you developed a new uh, unit for us? No, it's not that, but, well, it is about development, generally speaking. Have you noticed the difference between the crystals you obtained around Kimberly and those around Medina? Yeah, you actually start getting red crystals more often here than you do in, in Kimberly. Kimberly, you get white crystals here, you get red ones, so... 
red ones give you more uh, alienite or whatever when you or illuminate or whatever when you uh, crush crush them down. You get about double, so you get 30 instead of 15. So probably gives you reasons to go to other cities to do their missions to try and get more of a certain gem type that you're looking for for upgrades and stuff like that. There has there has to be a lot of red crystals around here. That's good. Now that you mention it, but still the same old enemies we're getting them from. Why is it that crystal colors vary so much from place to place? Eating uh. habits, uh, radiation, who knows? I'm glad you asked. It's because of the different impurities present. They give the, the crystals their colors. With different colors come different properties, and well, that's for another time. I saw it in a video game called Final Fantasy. They have different co they have different gems that have different abilities. I want the Geomancer cross. Hmm. Suffice to say that if you can get enough red crystals, I should be able to develop some stronger units for you. Hey! What, what are you all talking about over here? Did I hear something about stronger units? You're sure, your ears sure pick up whenever there's talk of new weapons. So is she the fe female love lock, basically? <laughs> hey, hey, I can't help it. I just love going down those bays. I see. Uh, yeah, I think her and love, uh, love lock are... Yeah, love lock would be a good couple just because of their level weapons. So, okay, so basically we need to get as many red crystals as we can. Precisely. I think I should be able to develop something pretty special with those crystals. All right, Doc. Leave it to us. I pu I'll pump those credits full of lead, and you'll get a whole bunch of red rocks. <laughs> you mean blood diamonds? Or I mean, sounds like a plan. Well, good luck. <laughs> Huh. When it's unit development, she's all jabber, jabber, jabber. If anything else, she's as cold as ice. She's as cold as ice. Don't need to sacrifice my love. Hold on, where's Toa? That the deputy commander should have been the one to feel that call. Toa? Why, she's over that s there slumped on the floor. Uh, uh, I think she's still breathing. <laughs> Never gonna happen. Oh, she was listening on the conversation. <laughs> Goodbye, wedding bells. Uh, I think you might have had a nerve or something when you said you were talking when you were talking to Chica. <laughs> well, isn't this just great? All right, now we need to destroy ten pigmas, which are those like landing, you know, like crawling unit things, and accept two dandelion dockings from Medina. So it means at least get two uh, missions done. So, because I think you could technically take out two, ten pigmas in like one go if you chose the right mission, but, uh... Alright, anyway. Command. Does that count? Like, does getting a dandelion after doing that mission count? Maybe it does. Who knows? Or did it say two... Maintenance now. It's easy to forget to rebuild bulwarks and other temporary units. So we're fine. I mean, we took some damage on the last episode. Let me see. Does it just say... It just says accept two dockings. Doesn't mean at the same time, so... Alright, get paid. Oh, and by the way, off-screen, uh, uh, if you go to the map, if you don't do a, a town after so many missions, their happiness slowly goes down. So I guess at some points they want you to go back to a town and maybe do a, a couple missions or maybe at least build some stuff to improve happiness to uh, uh, keep it at a decent amount. But we can we can leave that up alone for now. Oops. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Yep. Take that. I mean, we could wait to do it both at the same time if we really wanted to, so... I guess I could show some of the unique dialogue that they have, but... Eh. Oh, right, let's look at a R and Alright, got the immobilizer. Let's see, by firing more rounds, this unit freezes bosses longer. Oh, okay, so you got a stronger immobilizer. So that'll be something. Uh, so yeah, let's go ahead you and buy that. Yep. Yeah, it's, might as well have it in my op optional repertoire. It's very nice. Yeah, it's a only so. So and you might want to build one or the other depending on your money situation or whatever. Okay. Now that yeah, you have to you have to buy all this new stuff for the city if you uh, want to build it up as well because it doesn't come automatically with uh, with a lot of the stuff. So. Uh, we'll at least buy the blaster can and then save the rest Perfect. maybe for later. I'm in the mood for creating something with some You're not creating something, you're just redoing the same thing. That you had from before. That way if we needed uh, 
Yeah, I don't really have any, like, really good, like, setup for this place yet. Not really, anyway. Um, yeah, last mission I took some damage because I wasn't paying attention with my, uh, how, uh, how this is set up. Although, yeah, my, this shield wall took, like, a ton of damage last time because I wasn't paying attention. And I didn't really need to build it. Ooh, sorry. I don't need to build that in mobiles right now, so. I think I, I think I have enough gallons, really. Although, maybe I don't have enough uh, missile launchers or ways to, like, help uh, do extra damage. Yeah. Yeah, we'll buy one of those. And buy another. Buy another. Well, actually, do you want to buy two missiles there, or could we do two cannons, maybe? Because there's a few spots for that give you doubles. Now yeah, let's do a couple of cannons. Just uh, something extra to have. I don't want to build too much, because just in case when we start getting new weapons, you know, that type of thing. Alright, let's do another. Since we've got some Here time, what's... Oh, is it... A level 7 is the only one that I can do pigments for? Ugh. I mean, I... I the game... The, the, the town... The town does come with some... If you look, uh, I forgot to show it, but... Some of the buildings come with level 7 uh, units already, so that's not too bad. Um, I will have to update some of these others, but I kind of want to beef up the ones I've already got. For now. Starting the fortification work now. It'll be done before you can blink. Oh, I'm almost out of uh, almost out of uh, white crystals. I might have to go off screen, go back to the old town, and uh, and uh, do some missions there. So we'll see. The thing I'm worried, really, the thing I'm worried about is the uh, um, energy levels of my uh, operators. To yeah, I don't. I didn't want. I didn't want to do level seven, but uh, okay, we'll, we'll do it. We'll see if we can survive. Okay, let's do this. Okay, just gotta pay attention. I don't have as many units as I have from the previous one. Holy crap! This might not be good enough for this guy. Holy crap. Yeesh. Yeah, missiles may not have been, like, for what I wanted there. Oh, come on. Yeah, I might have to build up... A, I might have to build some new world works after this, because that... That one monster did like a ton of damage to me. Does can really only fire when it's like at a certain... Alright, oh, let's might as well move my gallons there to the uh... Be careful. Uh, okay, good. Yeah. Actually, having the three Gatlins and not being, you know, double or triple or whatever they are, it's actually not bad. Not a bad uh, way to build them. At least I think it's it might be a pretty solid uh, way to build them. They'll be within the city limits soon. Oh, okay, we're good. There's a giant on the scene. Huge one coming in. Stay sharp, everyone. Uh-oh. Look at that. Holy crap. It, like, destroys bulwarks. At least this level one right here. Uh-oh. Um, I almost forgot about you. Ah. Holy crap. Yeah, 
Yeah, I'll definitely have to uh, change that to Bulwarks. Although I am fighting a level 7 fight, so it's not like I'm, uh, you know. Awesome. It's not like I'm playing uh, Candy Crush or Candy Land over here or something like that. A, a triple threat. Triple threat! That's the way. Oh. Those guys out. Oh, I hate you. You really messed my day up. Uh oh, uh oh. Ah. Oh. Over to you, there we go. Just take out that. There you go. You're dead now. Okay, good. I think I. I think one of the bulks got destroyed. If I remember correctly. Ooh. Dinner with chesticles? Yes, please. Here's the report. All right. I wonder if that was enough to. Uh, Here are our strike uh, For the next one. All the data right yeah, it took a bit more. Yeah. Oh, we actually lost. Uh, yeah, we actually lost happiness, huh? I'll, I might have to buy. A, I might have to uh, buy some uh, like plants or recreational parks that like help. Uh, you can actually. Apparently, what happens is if you, I guess it's either fortifying or whatever, uh, or activate the event, you can just get a percentage of happiness. Like, I'll show it here in a second. Let me let me get to it. Which operator do? You um, okay. Yeah, we'll save Ashley because she can be swapped out for Lovelock. Um, I guess uh, she's the lowest right now. That's it for the Okay. All right. Yeah, I can defeat the Pigma, and then we should capture this one. A dandelion's arrived near the city commander. And then get that should count us too, right? Yeah, that bulwark got destroyed. I'll do uh. Me, uh, the mall says you get you do get some money back, but obviously it's not as much as uh, it's not as much as you did when you actually initially. Uh, oh right, anymore. Um, Blue side or whatever it is or luminaire. Luminaire. That'll work. Let me build some more full works. Just in case we do a, a more level 7 ep, uh, mission. Yeah. Whoops. Uh, that's not what I wanted to do, but okay. I mean, you do get more energy for your USW if you do that, so. Alright. Let's get the units. Oops. Yeah, from Catman Do. Catman Do Do. This should count as the second one for part of the mission, right? Yep. Alright. If we back out, we should... There we go. Land of red gold. Red gold. Gold red? Roger, roger? Red leader? Oh, now is a good time to... What's wrong? Oh, oh, Chica, what can uh, I do for you? Oh, there's something here to, to see you. Um, oh. Uh, I guess it's a... I'm gonna say lady. Yes, lady. Honestly, I sent a memo... No, no sorry. I'm sorry. I was trying to do like a serious, like deep lady voice. Honestly, I sent a memo to say I'd be arriving at 1500 hours sharp. I didn't expect to get absolutely zero response. Uh, oh gosh, yes, of course. I I'm so sorry, I totally forgot. Uh, it's today, isn't it? It's completely slipped my mind that we're getting another new addition to the okay. crew. Uh, th that's her? My name is Hikachi. I'm a deputy commander like Toa here. Well, not like her, actually. Oh, we can swap her out now to improve her energy. Good. I graduated from Academy last year, and I've been assigned to your crew as part of my fast track training. I was being assigned to us as fast tracking it? I don't imagine I'll be with you for long, but anyway, I trust we'll all be able to get along. Uh -huh. Yeah, I've heard of you. You're that prodigy who's getting allied command all excited, aren't what do you? What you mean? They're getting all hot bothered under their shirt there. A prodigy, huh? Uh, how'd she end up in our crew? Kachi has a weakness, which is that she has difficulty dealing with crew who aren't quite her level. I, I think we're well below her level if she's a prodigy. So she requested posting with us in order to learn how to better manipulate such crew. Okay. Manipulate? 
Uh, okay, sure. Oh, come on, she can at least give us a little credit. <laughs> Hello, everybody. I've just come up with the design for a fabulous new unit. Dot, dot, dot. Dot, dot, dot. Dot, dot, dot. Oh, Why is everyone dot, dot, dot in here? Dr. Chandler has the most amazing time in the world, doesn't she? Uh... What's happened? Why are you all so quiet today? Hmm? You happen, Chandler. You popped in like a bull in a china shop. A goddamn jack-in-the-box. Trying to double-team me and my girlfriend. I mean, uh... You haven't seen Mullily in a while. What's she what? up to? Did she even listen to me? And stop talking only when you're in a good mood. Hey. It's creepy. When are you coming to Copenhagen, Keo? We've got so much to talk about, wait you up, and me. Wait up. I'm not going to Copenhagen. We've been over this. If you want to talk, you come uh, here. Uh, why not? I heard Copenhagen is pretty nice. Well, actually, I don't know how nice it is in this alternate universe, you know, but still. This is getting a bit irritating. I'm leaving now. Boy, oh, you annoyed her, so. Ah, wait, Doctor. Didn't you say you came up with a new unit for us? Could you tell us more? Oh, yes, that's right. The device to weapon that fires a high powered laser beam. Freaking laser beam from their heads. Really, that sounds amazing. You're the best, Dr. Chandler. <laughs> oh, it's nothing. Anyway, let's just just see the world and I'll develop the blueprint. Remember, though, it's still an experimental model, so you can only bear it do it for now. Understood. Oh, so it's not a USW, it's just a regular laser. Huh, cool. Yeah. Gotta shoot fire in my laser episodes over here. Oh, yes, understood. I'm sure it'll be incredibly yeah. useful. Well, we'll have a peek in the R&D lab whenever you're ready to develop it. Phew! <laughs> Tough job being deputy, huh? She's a hard person to handle. Oh, oh I, I'm sorry, Tola. I might have been a bit out of line earlier. Uh, um, excuse me. I trust this isn't normal behavior among your crew, That's Toa. Right. No, I mean, it's fairly typical, but don't worry. It doesn't affect <laughs> their jobs. Don't worry. How can you possibly Stop. say that? It might be a bit a little disconcerting at first, but you get used to it. <laughs> I know I did. Ugh. Uh, uh, and everyone does their jobs. Uh, this should go without saying, don't you think? <laughs> I, I guess you got me there. <sighs> what a peculiar bunch of operators. Nikachi has been added to the crew. But yeah, I assume she's a uh, swap out for Toa. You can now develop the Rex laser. Like T-Rex lever? Mother frickin' T-Rex? Develop the Rex laser and build two Rex lasers of Medina. Okay, so we need some money to do that. So that'll be the next objective. All right. Although we probably... What's, do we have to fight any missions? Probably do that now, actually. I mean, I'm not going There's to, but... so much staring out of the window. Yeah, you got the, uh, got the red crystal, so... But we'll do that, uh... We'll do that in the next episode of Aegis of Earth, the Preventus Assault. We'll build the, uh, Rex lasers and improve Adenian and Warring. You maybe even get more people on my crew. So thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.